Okay, so this is, could be part two, the Calypso style Whirlpool. I did not have any luck trying to get a hold of Whirlpool. They asked me to contact a local service representative and I was on hold for 15 minutes and didn't want to hold on any longer. So this is this was the thing I was trying to get off. This has got these numbers on it. I couldn't figure out what the numbers were and it's got like this kind of things on the side here like you could use a tool or something to pull it off or something. But what had happened is it just rusted on that bearing there. That this part here was rusted on inside there. That's why it wouldn't pull off. I tried to pull it off with two hammers prying it in there to pull it off and I finally got it off. Um, I didn't want to break it and I thought there might be some trick to it but there's no trick it's just that that thing was rusted on there and so now as we can see once again that this basket is too loose and what I found was that there's what they call the spanner nut underneath this part here I haven't taken this apart yet, but I'm going to go ahead and see if I can. So there's a spanner nut that holds this tub on that and this thing here does not come off too easy either. So Anyway, there's a spanner nut underneath the tub that I need to figure out how to take off and put on. That thing, I don't know where that came from. Okay, okay, here it is. Little rubber things go right here. But anyway, yeah, continued. Next episode, I still need to figure out how to get this spanner nut which is underneath that rubber boot spanner nut there it's all corroded supposedly it holds the basket up and so I need to get to that to, in order to put the basket in its place